Hello everyone, PBS Black Queen here, a young CEO, and I'm here with a product review for you. If you've been watching my channel, you know that I've been doing this wash and go series where I go in and I'm trying different gels this summer and trying to perfect the wash and go because like I've, met, I've said before, I really don't do wash and goes because I always they always turned out a hot mess and I didn't think I could do them, but I'm getting better with practice and I think I found a technique that works for me. So now I'm just trying out products just to see what works. I'm using mostly gels, all right? And the gel that I've used this time is this one right here. This is the LA Look Sport Gel, all right? And this gel is 20 ounces, is the container. It has a hold of 10, as you can see. And it is... It has tri-active hold for superior fixation, hold, and durability. This gel is alcohol-free. This gel has protein in it, and this gel does not contain glycerin. You cannot see the back of the label. I'm going to have to put the ingredients down below, but that's what the back of the label looks like. As you can see, It's uh, you can't really see that, so I'm just going to put the uh, ingredients down below. All right, I do know that this gel is also curly girl friendly. So if you are doing the curly girl method and you're looking for a gel that is inexpensive and on the ground, I suggest you get this one and give it a try. All right, the gel is in my hair right now um, and my hair feels really, really good and it looks good as you can see, at least I think so. I'll try and get in. I don't have Zoom. I'm on my iPad right now, but that's what my curls look like. As you can see, I have a lot of definition. And again, I think my hair looks good and it feels good. When I put this on my hair, it does dry with a hold. It does have a gel cast like all gel does. And, you know, you just scrunch out the crunch or you can use in or use a leave-in or a moisturizer. I did use a leave-in or a moisturizer after my hair was 100% dry. I did go in and use a, um, a moisturizer just to soften my hair and just to see how it would play with this gel. And I'm going to do a separate review on what I use because I think that leave-in or that moisturizer that I use deserves, you know, its own video. So I'm going to do that in a few minutes actually, okay? This gel can be found anywhere. This can be found at your Rite Aid, your CVS, your grocery stores like Kroger, it can be found at Walgreens, Walmart, Dollar General Market. I got mine at Dollar General. This was about a dollar eighty. There's always a um, a coupon in Sunday's paper for a few cents off as well. And let me just say that this gel also comes in different colors, just like Eco Styler gel comes in different colors with different hold levels. I know for a fact that there is a yellow one. There is a clear one, there's a pink one, of course there's a blue one. So it, there's like maybe four or five different gels uh, that LA Looks have out there. And uh, this gel, like I said, it smells, let's smell it here. It smells really good. It has like a clean, fresh scent. It smells, it reminds me of, oh, what's that scent? Bath and Body Works has a scent, Ocean Breeze or Ocean something or another. That's what it smells like. Or let's see, dare I say this, it smells like Irish Spring Soap. Not the green one, but the blue one. Whatever that blue one is called, it smells like that. And it's not a strong smell and it doesn't linger in your hair. So it does go away once you apply it. So if you are sensitive to smells, don't be alarmed by using this. Let me um, see if I can get some of it out to show you what it looks like. All right, so this is what the gel looks like. Let me get in there a little bit. Get some of my fingers. Whoa, there we go right there. Can you see, can you see? This is the texture of the gel right there. And it feels smooth. Like I said, it's got that awesome smell to it. I'm just gonna stick that in my hair. And how I apply this gel is after I cleanse my hair, you know, I <clears throat> I take my spray bottle and I kind of wet my hair a little bit and then I just start, you know, raking it through my hair like so, section by section. I have to use small sections. That that's the key. 
for me is using very small sections while I am um, putting this on my hair. And again, I let it dry 100% and then I use my leave-in um, the next day. And in the morning time, when I take my, um, my satin bonnet off, I will reactivate my curls by spraying it with water. And if, if needed, I'll take a little bit of this gel and I'll kind of scrunch it in my hair like so. All right, I kind of scrunch it in there just to reactivate my curls and to wake my curls up a little bit. My, this gel does not flake on me. I have not had any flakage and this is three day hair right here that I'm working with. Doesn't have any flakage on me. It does dry with a crunch that you have to scrunch out a little bit. You know, all gel has gel cast. You guys know that. So, and like I said, there's no flakiness. It's not tacky or sticky or anything like that. It's, um, it's a good gel. I didn't think I would like this gel when I uh, first purchased this. And I've had this gel for, for a while. I purchased it, like I said, a while ago. And it was just in my stash. And when I started doing the Wash and Go series, this summer I said hmm I'm gonna try this again I haven't used this for a twist out so I'm not exactly sure how it would work for a twist out I've only used it for a wash and go and the first time I used it I didn't like it because I don't I think I was doing it wrong and I was using too much but you know a little does go a long way as well you really don't need a lot of this gel either and Let's see, like I said, it's really good. It's inexpensive and my hair likes it. I think my hair looks amazingly awesome. It really does. I think it has some movement to it. As you can see, there's movement. Like I said, it doesn't flake or anything. Doesn't leave my hair dry, but I think it has something to do with the little leave-in that I use as well. So um, yeah, that's all I'm gonna say about this gel right here. If you have used this gel, Go ahead and leave a comment down below. Let's go ahead and let's talk about it, all right? Uh, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe either. Do all three. They're free for crying out loud. What's up to everyone at YouTube Noir? What's up to everyone in the Orange Blossoms? I hope you guys have a fantastic day. Thank you guys for watching. I know there's a, probably a lot of reviews on this gel, but yet you took the time out, you stopped, and you watched my video. And for that, I thank you very, very much. Again, I hope you have a fantastic day, and I will talk to you guys next time. All right? Mwah. See you soon.